Support Laneside. Get something cool. Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Laneside Reviews. As always, I'm the bearded beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter. And we've got some really exciting stuff to show you on this episode, so why don't we take it Laneside and see how it's stacked up. All right, guys, welcome back. As always, we're joined by Wayne Porter, our speed dominant player. Yeah, he's born on the easy house shot. Are you sure that's not the Sahara Desert? Because <laughs> that looked like there was no oil out there. This ball would make most shots look like the deserts. So All of them. <laughs> we got the dark web here from Hammer. Um, and out of the box, the cover feels like a porcupine. <laughs> Um, and when I looked up the cover stock on it, lo and behold, we're looking at the Aggression Solid cover stock. And I think we've seen this on a couple of other balls before, haven't we? Oh, yes, we have. Quite a few. So, uh... We got the Black Widow 2.0. Uh-huh. We got now the Dark Web. Yep. The Redemption Solid. Which is a, a really a strong super ball. super strong ball. And we got the Rip Solid. Which is another super strong ball. ball. And then we got the Statement Solid, which huh. is like one of their strongest balls. And, and the Sauce. Which is probably the strongest symmetric that Hammer's had in the last five years. Till now. Till now. Till now. Now we're looking at the Dark Web. Yeah. So, um... He's still moving left. Yeah. <laughs> Eric got some oil this time. Ooh, Good yeah. lord. Um, so we haven't even touched on the core yet. Oh, yeah, that's right. So, so not only has they, they went out and got the most aggressive cover stock to put on this web, Yep. they've modified the original core from the web series. Yeah, it's almost, it's it's really different. It's like a cross between a web core and like a Rodman or a original yeah. web core, and then there's yeah. a flip block, block. and... You know, it, you know what it looks like? It looks like one of those 50s cats with the eyes that go back and <laughs> back forth if it was wearing a little hat. hat. <laughs> yeah. It looks like a torpedo because that's what it does to the pins if you get it there. Yeah. Um, I mean, look at that leave. Ugh. So, yeah, yeah. W we've got Wayne here. He jumped five and three left of his um, benchmark spot to uh, at least get the ball to the pocket. Um, that was another four, or sorry, another three and two after that yeah. to leave that um, leave that four eight. eight. <laughs> Who leaves a four eight? eight? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at this one. That's really inside. Yeah, this one <laughs> probably, you know, maybe not the best for the speed dominant player unless he's on heavier oil. Like yeah, like if it was like a a forty foot flat. I think it would work. You could play the outside again. <laughs> yeah, because we, we normally, I yeah. mean, we're very honest. We say speed dominant players and symmetric doesn't generally look the best. Yeah. I mean, that looked pretty decent there. Yeah. That's scorable. But look how far into the lane he is. Yeah. You know, and that's uh, out of his comfort zone. Yeah. Eventually, he's going to get, he gets forced too far left, and then the ball doesn't turn the corner, and yeah. nobody has a good day. Yeah. Here he is against the bonus. Now, I mean, you could fix that. That's it's what five hundred, fifteen hundred of the box. Yeah, there's a lot of surface to play with. Fif yeah, five hundred, fifteen. So that's a little skip sand. Yeah. Then, so we could you could you know get a thousand in between maybe and then smooth it out a little bit or put a little bit of compound uh, on to get yeah. some more room. Yeah. You can see here that when it was good, it was about five boards different, but m way way yeah. earlier, yeah. like three to six feet yeah. earlier. This ball picks up strong. Really? I mean, yes. And I mean, out of all of those balls that was on that list, uh -huh. I owned all, all of, of them, them. <laughs> um, because you're going to see why. But yeah, here I, you are. I was not expecting this. I'll tell you. Well, no, because you play the statement solid and the juice. They're in. They're yeah. in your bag. And the statement solid is kind of when you have to get away from your urethane and you move in. Yeah. That's your ball that turns the corner. Yeah. Is this stronger than that? Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. Uh, there's no... It... Because it's symmetric, it just keeps going. Yep. Right? Um, all those other ones... A, a lot of the other ones they talk about are asymmetric. So this is one of the few symmetric ones they put this cover on. And it's like... The, even the sauce wasn't this strong. Like the core and the sauce didn't have like a flip lock or anything on it. So yeah. it didn't 
change directions like it, this one does. Yeah, it's it's so early. I think this that's is that's inside. Wow, this is a ball that's going to have to be for heavier oil. Yeah, when you are trying to create friction. Yes, uh, this thing is a Brillo pad. <laughs> like it's <laughs> like it, I said, there, there's. We could tweak the cover and everything, but I, I don't think I would want to. I think, yes, this would have be a special place in my bag for, like you said, like when urethane's not working and it's like a really long shot that I can't get it or I've, everybody else is playing urethane and I want to get in a different spot. Yeah, you need the right? ball to pick up yeah. and, and read because it's muddy. Yeah. Yeah. So you, when you struck the first time, you were 10 boards left. Now you're 13 boards left. It just still goes like that. It just yeah. It it's it picks up strong, <clears throat> but it it never gives up. That's the thing. It's definitely. I think for me, it would definitely be a tournament uh, ball for sure, or or sports league, or the day that the lane machine breaks and there's no back end. Oh, that never happens. Never. Oh, you know, <laughs> I was gonna say that. That that might just have a permanent spot just for the the uh, yeah. the Swiffer Knights. The Swiffer Knights, yeah. We uh, every once in a while. Oh, look at that! That's better. That every once nice. in a while, our lane machine will decide to not strip anymore, or just not put down oil, or both. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, our uh, local center manager Tom is awesome because he goes out there and he he hand mm. oils them. Yeah. On you know, nice spray minutes, bottle yeah. and Swiffer for the leagues and tries to literally tries to make them even, tries to make sure he goes the same direction. Yeah, he tries to shape them so they're playable. Yeah, he's awesome. Yeah. But we end up with a lot of oil. Yeah. Um, nothing wrong with that yeah. because uh, well, I think we've got a ball for it. Look at this one. No! Oh! Didn't quite get that one. Oh, but I think he lost the game. Oh. <laughs> got myself. Oh. Oh. Yeah. yeah, no, I think you... Um, you still have to lift the ball. Yes. That's a big thing. I know when you turned around the first thing, you, you were like, yeah, no no hand. No hand, yeah. <laughs> so, and it happens to the best of us. So, I mean, I imagine it happens to the worst of us, too. So. Oh, I'm sure. I mean... So, that means I'm up for a gutter eventually. <laughs> Someday. You can oh. see this one. I really came around this one. Oh! Yeah. Yeah. So, this is... It, it is definitely a good ball. It's just, it's not for a house shot, I don't think. No, I don't think. Unless you have a heavy house shot or yeah. you play someplace that, you know, brand new synthetic lanes, there's no track Traction, in them yet. Yeah. Um, this is going to be a ball that you'll have to change surface. But yeah. for tournament bowlers, oh, yeah, this is going to be a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, but it's not your traditional web. No, no, this is definitely nothing like, the web pearl that I play in league or the, the original web or the web, the, yeah. the tour hybrid. Red, yeah. Yeah. It, it is a different motion. Yeah. So, but is that a bad thing? No, no. That's the thing is it's, it's a phenomenal ball. It's just not quite what we expected. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He put it down and it pulled the, uh, it, I think it pulled the water out of the ground. Look at right. that. Look at it. It went inside and outside, and it's not often I get to play that, was that a, much. That was about 10, 12 boards difference. Yeah. So here I am with it, and um, it's going to be no um, no surprise to anyone. Yeah, it's not making... No. Not I, making I, was, I, was a, I was impressed it hit the head bend, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah. Wow. <laughs> I, uh... I, uh... Yeah. I threw it, and I, as soon as it came off my hand, I was like, oh, that's good, because I was thinking my bonus. I'm yeah. like, oh, that's a strike, no problem. Yeah. And then I think it checked bef just about the beginning of the first cheater board. Right. So, like, 30, 31 to 34 feet. It, it, oil what? <laughs> yeah. Where? You know. Um, I really liked the Web Tour Hybrid. Yeah. Um, for a while, it replaced my Intel in my house shot bag. Yeah. Um, you know, my bonus is my, my favorite ball. The web tour hybrid was probably number two ish Intel. Yeah. So when I threw this, I was kind of expecting that web motion. Yeah. As you saw, <laughs> it is not. No. 
Um, this kind of reminds me of some of the big solids we saw, like the um, the Magnitude 055 from Brunswick. Okay, yep. Cover-wise, because it's just such a big, strong cover, but it still has motion down lane. Yeah. Um, but the core, the core dynamics don't, it's so weird. The core dynamics with it being a little higher RG and a little lower differential, you would expect it to still perform a little bit like a web. Yeah. But I found this to be closer to, that was there, bad, yeah. closer to like a, a Black Widow. Yeah. Or um, I didn't get to throw the ripped, but I got to throw the, yeah. s- the statement. statement. Yeah. Um, so just like you were saying, this is probably the strongest cover stock that Hammer has. Yeah. Wrapped with a core that dynamically seems to rev up very nicely when the cover stock's friction seems to take oh, over. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's The combination is just phenomenal. And that's what I mean. I love the shape. When you can get to where you need to get it to, yep. the shape is phenomenal. Like, it's it's everything I look for in, in a, a true shape. Like, I like I can hit them thin there. I, yeah. I can make my pocket rather wide. I can bury it. I can make it re- relatively yeah. thin. Um, the one downfall, just like uh, everybody else, this cover stock is super duper strong. Yeah. For the summer leagues, um, it might be a little bit too much. Sport though, man. Yeah. Oh man. Yes, I don't think I think you could play it on Anything, short, medium, heavy. Yeah. Just depends on where you want to stand. Like I would but. like to, I would like to see this on short pattern. Yeah. Um, not the super short, but like the old, um, the old cheetah. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, well, that, you got out of room. I ran out of room, yeah. yeah. Uh, at that point, I'm at, uh, I think I'm 15 left. Yeah, I, mean, I would, Every ball is going to run out at, at some point. Eventually, like, yeah. yeah. I would like, as I was saying, I'd like to see this on the Cheetah. Yeah. I'd love to see this on some of the, the, the higher volume, longer patterns. Oh, yeah. Because I think when you need to create that friction and control it, I think this ball is going to shine even more than what we're we're seeing here. Oh, for sure, yeah. Um, you know, did we strike every time with it? No. Oh, look at that. Yeah. But that cover stock, you think this this cover stock for me? Yeah, I'm probably saying at least five to ten, if not more, boards stronger than my bonus. And you're gonna oh, see yeah. it right here. Easy. And the shape is so much different. It's a little bit more snap and roll yeah. than my covered bonus a lot. was. Covered a lot of boards. It covered a ton of boards. So um, this is not your your typical benchmark ball. This no. is going to be for heavy oil. Yeah. But when it comes to heavy oil, this thing is going to be a traction god. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a show. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.